All right, what is up, Crazy X? Welcome to Healthy Wednesday. Uh, today, of course, my status update. Uh, and of course, like I said, I'm going to build a community here. I'd love to hear from you, you guys. What are some of your health goals? Uh, what are you doing to achieve those? And yeah, I mean, Wednesday's a good day to do an update. It's the middle of the week. You got time to uh, make adjustments and uh, just just good time. You know, right in the middle of the week, like, you know, I need to step it up for the rest of this week. Um, I, I do measure from Sunday to Saturday, but I take today as the day to kind of update. And, you know, as I said, sometimes I'll be like, oh, yeah, I dropped last week. Uh, I, I need to crank that up for the rest of this week. So, uh, yeah, with that, let's dig in. So, my weight today, well, not today, but as of Saturday, <laughs> weight for last week was 317.1. Last week, 316.5. I went up six tenths of a pound. I mean, not a lot. It is something to kind of keep track of and be aware of. That way, if I need to, you know, course correct. If you, you know, you start seeing trends going up, well, I need to do more. <laughs> now, this week, I don't know. Like, I can see my weight going one of two directions. Yeah, there's only two direct, up and down. But, um, of course, this week I'm down here in it. I showed you guys the other day, but put this around here. <laughs> no, I'm not down in Egypt. It looks like Egypt. But that is behind the scene of the Sphinx. Uh, I showed this the other day in another video. There's two. Uh, it's actually their uh, jet line fuel. But if you remember in the hangover, that's a spot where they pull off the road because they heard commotion in the trunk and there's a plane taking off. And they thought it was their best friend, Doug. Instead, it was Ken Jong, who ironically enough is in this hotel that I'm in right now. Kind of funny, he filmed a scene right there, and he's here now. <laughs> but yeah. So we're here. And that's why I said my weight's going to do one of two things. It's either going to go up or it's going to go down. <laughs> but why? <laughs> and it's really one of the same thing. I mean, I'm obviously not drinking a lot or nothing while I'm down here. But the reason it can either go up or down is because I am destroying my feet. You guys remember the first Saw movie where they had to cut off their legs? I get it. They just got back from Vegas too, I'm sure. <laughs> you take a ton of steps down here. Uh, I actually got to see Carrot Top last night, and I remember this before, but he has a joke, you know, where they do that, Viva Las Vegas. He's like, it's time that they do a new song. And they start doing that, I would walk 500, <laughs> you know, uh, just because that's all you do, you know. Oh, wait, I forgot something in my hotel room. I got to turn around. I would walk 500. Okay, well, now I'm going to go over to this hotel. I will walk 500. Just like everything is stepped. All you do is walk. So I'm either going to build up my, like muscular legs. I mean, my leg biceps. You know, Hulk Hogan had the 19-inch pythons or the 22-inch pythons. I'm going to have the 22-inch... Uh, calves, <laughs> right? Wait, calf. No, it's ankle. I don't know, <laughs> but you know, you know what I'm saying. Uh, yeah. So steps are gonna go through the roof, and that can cause weight gain because it could create muscle, and muscle weighs more than fat. But because I am taking all these steps, I'm burning a ton of calories, so I might lose fat. So it's just gonna be a question of am I gonna gain more muscle? or gain or lose more <laughs> more fat I, one of two things will happen that's for sure but whichever way it goes it will be a healthy change <laughs> uh, so of course another thing that would bring up is uh, body fat body fat last week was 41.9 this week 41.3 <laughs> that went down six tenths 
kind of funny. One goes up six tenths, and one the other goes down six tenths. Uh, but I mean, it means I've got less body fat, so that's definitely an improvement. I mean, it could also be water, because I mean, that's the key thing: is it's uh, it's lean weight. It, you know, like the, but it, it's got like water and stuff in there too, so it might not necessarily be all uh, all fat, but I like to think it is. <laughs> Water consumption. There were a couple of days I didn't properly track, so I estimated. Uh, last week I had 32.5, this week 31. So by my estimations, I went down 1.5. I feel that's pretty accurate. Uh, but I may have said the same, you know. And then that's a hard thing. Like, I did finally find a thing of water down here, but water even is expensive down here. So it's like, yeah, drinks aren't always the best. Sometimes there's a little soda, well, a bit of soda, because it's kind of almost cheaper in a way. But, uh, or especially, it's a lot more easily obtainable. But we'll, of course, correct that. And like I said, I'm taking a ton of steps, so, I mean, it's not a good choice. But, uh, like I said, I found a thing of water, and I bought, like, a gallon of it, so I can start pouring that through my body, because it's also something that your body's going to need when you're out in the desert. All right, and the last part, steps. Uh, I think before I said last week, I mean, it's actually technically two weeks ago. Uh, I was at 4374 steps. That's my average steps a day for that week. Uh, and then truly last week, I hit 5,168. I said that went down. That did not go down. That went up. <laughs> 5,000 is more than 4,000. So uh, I took 794 more average daily steps. Well, that is my update for you guys for this week. Uh, here's a tip for you guys. If you do want to help, you know, you want to really get motivated and lose some weight, go to Vegas, walk around. <laughs> no. uh, uh, it is a good spot, though. But yeah, just get out, walk. I mean, as I said, that's why we have Motivational Mondays. There's a lot of depression going around right now, a lot of negativity. And we seem to not naturally consume it, it just is put upon us. So go out and walk, take some steps, get some fresh air. Uh, I mean, it's also too, it's, it's a little bit harder to be depressed or have negative feelings when you have endorphins going. So yeah, just take, just walk around the block. I mean, get out there, enjoy the fresh air, Hopefully it's dry where you're at, not not like Oregon where it rains all the time. All right, everybody, thank you so much for checking out our video. Please comment down below. Tell us where you're working on, what your goals are. Uh, just any kind of feedback is always appreciative. And give this video a like. And also, if you haven't already, subscribe. I appreciate it. Thanks, everyone. Stay crazy, my friends.